Hollywood made a visit to North Canton this past week. I first gave you an inside look at the film Takedown, written and directed by North Canton native Eddie McClintock in January. Well, filming just wrapped up Sunday. So I stopped by the set to learn more about the film and why McClintock feels it's important to introduce new people to the film industry. It's been lights, camera, and action in North Canton lately. All in all, all these people are volunteering and um, it's been a good experience. Actor and North Canton native Eddie McClintock just wrapped up shooting his latest movie takedown this past week. Throughout his career, McClintock has been in hit TV shows like Warehouse 13 and No Good Nick. But in recent years, he's decided to step behind the camera to write and direct. Takedown will be his second film. The first was Miracle at Manchester, which was released last year. I think we're getting what we need to have a, a cohesive story, you know, um, and get the stuff that I wrote so that we can tell the story that I wanted to tell. Takedown is based on McClintock's high school years as a troubled teen, trying to balance life between wrestling, his passion for the arts, and parents with mental health challenges. He's playing a role loosely based around his father. McClintock hopes this movie helps teenagers develop the courage to ask adults for help while overcoming adversity. If a kid can watch this and go, oh, okay, I'm kind of feeling that same way and it's okay to talk about it and you know, or they watch the film with their parents and then they can, you know, not have to feel so alone. Scenes took place at locations all across the North Canton area, like the reserve at Stone Creek. It's going to be fun to you know, say, oh, I know where that is. The event center typically hosts weddings, but owner David Reese is thrilled to have a movie set added to his list. I was a big fan of Warehouse 13, so I watched Eddie McClintock, you know, for years when he was on that show and you know and just seeing the extras and having seeing them come in and talking to each other because they know each other from different films and that it's kind of it's fun. McClintock says bringing movie sets outside of Hollywood is vital to keep introducing new people to the industry. There's people that are interested in film all over the place and you know they're, they're interested and they, they want to know what it's like to be involved um, and they never get an opportunity. I just want to thank the people of North Canton for being so supportive. You know, hopefully, like I said, I make, a, I make something that can help somebody. Post-production for the film will take around six months, and McClintock says there will be a movie premiere at a local theater. And Mark, when I was talking to McClintock about all of this, he was filming this entire movie during our week of whiplash weather here in Northeast Ohio, and he said he's really surprised he got it all done. Well, the movie takes place over the course of a year, and we had every season. <laughs> yes, During I that week he was did. filming, so you're welcome, Mr. <laughs> McClintock. Well done.